Très bien. A splendid rendition, girls. Now, to your lesson. May you have a maximally fruitful day on your journey to become miniature ladies par excellence. All together now. Merci, Monsieur Medaille. Merci, Monsieur Medaille. Merci, Mesdemoiselles. Mm -hmm. What have we here? It is not so often that we receive les visiteurs. It is a minimally common occurrence, in fact. Incroyable! I do not believe it! Young man, it must have been fate that brought you here. Destiny! La Providence! I sense a great power within you. A power of maximal significance. There is much to discuss, but not out here. Eh? Come to my office, and I will reveal all you need to know. It is nearby, a minimal distance. You will see! <laughs> ah, there you are! Now, uh, you must allow me to introduce myself properly. I am Maxime Medaille! And this is my humble establishment, l'Académie de notre Maître des Médailles, a school in which miniature ladies bloom into beautiful, full-grown flowers. As part of the education, we encourage our pupils to journey through all the lands of Edrea, and to gather the maximum number of mini medals they can find. As they hunt for medals, they immerse themselves in the cultures of the world and acquire at least a minimum of, uh, how you say, savoir-faire. But every so often, a born medal hunter comes along. I sense this in you. I see the most maximally adroit medal detector of my career before me. However, there is one miniature problem. The Academy is for young girls and young girls alone. Sadly, I cannot offer you a place here. But does this mean I will allow such potential maximal to remain untapped? No! By the power vested in me, I hereby enroll you as an honorary member of l'Academy de Notre Maître de Médaille!
Out of the way, Drongos. Some of us have got sights to see. I see this place is still full of friendly visitors. We passed through a while back on the hunt for clues about Mordigan, you see. The beatific smile of the mural of the ruins of now what brings good fortune to all who lay eyes upon it. Well, if they believe that kind of rubbish, I'm guessing you didn't find out much of any use. <laughs> Aye, that's right, laddie. Not a sausage. But we're looking for something different now. And with the luminary with us too. I have a feeling it might be worth taking another look at those ruins with fresh eyes. We'll have to make our way through town and over the top of the mountain to get there. Let's split up and see what we can find out on the way. Doesn't it just break your heart? The poor thing's lost her parents. Oh, don't cry, sweetie. It's all right. We'll help you find them. Now, why don't you tell me your name? Dora. M my name's Dora. I came here with my mother and father, but, but then they left me behind. They said the, the mural was going to make them rich, and, and then they just went. <laughs> please, please help me. I want, I want them back so badly. <laughs> oh, there, there, little one. We'll find out where they've gone. Don't you worry. I'll take the town, you search the ruins, okay? I knew you wouldn't let me down. Sylve's detective agency to the rescue. Let the search begin. came for a look at the mural everyone's talking about too, huh? Well, here it is. I guess it is pretty impressive. I still don't believe all that stuff about it being lucky, though. She's not exactly in the best condition, but yes, you're right, she's beautiful. Ooh. What's that around her neck? 
It looks like some kind of strange key. <gasps> Not just any old strange key. Serena, that's the magic key. I'm sure of it. <sighs> Was that your stomach, Veronica? You're hungry again? Sheesh. No, it was not. Maybe if you weren't so clearly distracted by this impressive lady here, you'd realize that didn't sound anything like my tummy rumbling. Oh, shut up, you little brat. Oh, I saw where your, your eyes stomach's were like going. A creature you can't rising from the me. deep. There she blows, and just like she looked in my dreams too, this little beauty's gonna make old Bazza rich. Hey, there's plenty of room for everybody to look, you know. Hmm. I know your game, Spikey. Well, you can't keep it all to yourselves, you know. We deserve a chance to get rich too. Stop trying to hog all the good luck, you selfish so-and-sos. Yeah. Give someone else a chance to be happy, why don't you? Um, I think we should probably leave, don't you? <sighs> wow. I was pretty keen to see the mural, but clearly not as keen as some. Hmm. What is it? Is there something else worrying you? Huh. So you're looking for this kid's parents, huh? Well, we got nothing better to do. Let's see what we can find. There you are, my trusty sidekick! <laughs> hmm? <laughs> Alas, I found no sign of the missing persons in town. Did you have any luck here? Hmm, it is a puzzling mystery indeed. Ah, but I am forgetting our young client. A detective cannot leave a child in distress. Come, we must find her. <sighs> you are visitors here, yes? You come from far, far away? Welcome to Phnom Non. First, I should introduce myself, I think. My name is Muni, and I am Phnom Non's number one memorabilia merchant. If you want a souvenir of your trip or some tasty local produce, you must come to me. I have the best deals in town. Ah, uh, it's no good. We've searched high and low, but we can't find her anywhere. The poor little darling has disappeared. <gasps> you are searching for someone, yes? Then you are very lucky. Oh? Do you know how to find people? Yeah. She is the boss of the inn in this village. She knows everything about people who are coming and going here. Agree to spend the night between our clean and sumptuous sheets, and I'm certain she will share with you her knowledge. You do not need to worry about the cost. The first night, we will offer entirely for free. You are happy with this deal, yes? Good! Very good! I will tell my wife that you are coming.
there's nobody here. I thought you said you saw Dora come this way. If she did, she's disappeared into thin air. Are you sure? Hey, look up there! How strange. The mural. It's different from the last time we were here. Uh, am I going crazy? Or were those people not there yesterday? And doesn't that one look a whole lot like that Baza guy, the grumpy one? The lady at the inn said he didn't come back last night. Hmm... I've got a bad feeling about this. We need to get out of here now! <gasps> This is no good. It won't open. The mural. <sighs> What the... What is this place? It feels like we're dreaming, but we're not. Right? No, we're... I think we're... inside the mural. Uh... Um... That doesn't make any sense. Is this what happened to little Dora, too? Oh, that poor, poor thing. <laughs> All right, listen up. We've got a little girl to save. Let's go to work. Hey, look. It's our pal Baza. Hey. I said hey! What's with all the waving around? Yes. What are they all doing, I wonder? And what about this mural? It's the same as the one from the ruins. Who exactly is she? Huh. I don't know, but she's a charmer, all right. She's certainly got this lot under her spell. <laughs> Does my beauty not captivate you too, child? Perhaps when you were a little older. <gasps> <laughs> Why so confused, little ones? I am here. Right here! <gasps> Wait! Look! The, the mural! It, it's... alive! Let me see now. Red, orange, yellow, green. Yes! All the colors of the rainbow! The seven of you will be very welcome here. Especially you. There's something different about you. Something particularly... Vibrant! Now come, little ones! Brighten my world! Let me squeeze the color from you as I did the others! Let me add you to my masterpiece! 
<laughs> what? What are you talking about? <laughs> you will soon see. You will soon be immortalized in vivid streaks of color. <laughs> Everyone, come back! Okay, you don't need to tell me what a bad idea this is, but we need to find Dora. Come on, let's go grab her and get out of here. Doesn't feel safe at all. This way. So this thing has been luring folks in here so can have them for dinner, eh? Oh, lucky old us. <gasps> Careful! We need to run, right now! It seems to have been written by the person who discovered the mural. I have found a great fresco in the ruins near Phnomnon. It seems to be several centuries old. It has a strange power. At first I thought it was a power for good. That this was how people had been drawn here. How the town had grown great. But now I see that it is evil. That it lures the greedy with promises of riches so that it might feast on their souls. And those too pure of heart to tempt with greed, it lures through pity. Beware the little lost girl. She will lead you to your doom. The little lost... Hmm. 
So this whole thing was just... I think it's time to get out of... Could this be... <gasps> it is! It's the crack we saw when we first went to look at the mural. I think she's right, you know. This could be our way out of here. <gasps> Only one way to find out. Here goes nothing. Well, I've made more graceful entrances. Is everybody okay? More or We have to let everyone know the truth about the mural. Come on, let's get back to the village. <laughs> 